So hey guys, it's Drew here at Strata Health and Fitness, and today we're going to be talking about some breathing patterns and what kind of typically presents into the office. So usually what we see a lot of the time is that people will come in and be uh, more so chest breathers, and what this does is it doesn't allow us to use our diaphragm as optimally as we should be when we're breathing, and it'll lead us into this more open scissor position where we're putting a lot more stress on the joints in the low back and the muscles back there, and we're not optimally using the core and the diaphragm. So what we like to do for some breathing exercises is first have everybody kind of sit down and just take your hands and fingers and wrap it around the sides of your waist, just above your waist bones. And what you want to do here is breathe deeply into the stomach and the belly. And what you want is a full 360 degree expansion of your fingers. So you want to feel some pressure coming in through the front part of the stomach. You want to feel some pressure through the sides as well as the back side as well. And as you see, you kind of just go out like this. So an easy way to do this is just breathe in for about three to four seconds, hold for one to two seconds, and then breathe out for three to four seconds. So it'll look something like this. And having the fingers on your own waist is a really good cue where you can feel it yourself and where you need to add a little bit more pressure to get that uh, full expansion out of the diaphragm there. And once you've figured out how to do it here, uh, seated, uh, easy transition, make it a little bit more challenging for you is to lay on your back. And what we want to do here is just have the feet relax on the table with the hips and knees flexed a little bit. And it's the same idea. So index, middle finger, and your thumb going to go right around the waist. And then we're going to breathe here as well. So same idea, four seconds in, one to two second hold, and then four seconds out. And again, you want to feel that full expansion going at all 360 degrees. And once you've mastered that, you can add a little bit more challenge to it by going into the dead bug position or tabletop. So hips and knees at 90 degrees. And then same thing with the hands and fingers. And then breathe again.